Udenborn is a district in central Germany. Here a local road with a sewer and water pipe was renovated. The work required was carried out by the company Fritz Franke from Morschen. Traditional compacting machines such as roller conveyors and hand-guided vibratory plates were used to compact the frost protection layer and topsoil. The required compression values were not achieved while huge vibrations were transmitted to the surrounding houses at the same time, so the work had to be discontinued. Here the stair plate compressors once again demonstrated their superiority. Here too the water glass test, by the way also an invention by Jürgen Steyr, was used. As can be seen impressively, no vibrations are created in a glass filled with water, placed in the immediate vicinity. The patented suspension to the carrier unit allows the weight of the non-oscillating upper part to be adjusted continuously to the vibrating lower part of the plate compactor. It was Steyr who found that in conventional compacting over 50% of the energy applied is released into the environment as pointless vibrations. As a result, cracks have often arisen in the facades of houses or in buildings in the immediate vicinity. Valuable energy, which is not only lost, but also causes damage. Listen to the foreman from the company Franke, Mr. Gebauer. I am here on the foreman site. We had started on the excavation work and it was dry, yes, really dry. We then attempted to fit antifreeze material and to compact the material with a conventional roller. The results were catastrophic and the worst thing on top of that was the vibrations on the houses. These were so strong that we had to stop the work to prevent any damage to the houses. This meant that we had to compact the large areas with small compacting machines. This was totally inefficient. As a result we looked at the Steyr company and then used Steyr machines. A plate compactor mounted on a wheel loader. During the first compacting run we were already hitting values that we had not even come near to with conventional road construction rollers. And the shocks on the buildings actually were more towards zero. There was no evidence of anything. We called in a publicly appointed soil expert who confirmed this in a compaction test. The values were so good and we would never have achieved these with normal conventional equipment like for example the roller compactor. Another benefit is simply the operating costs, which are a lot lower. When we work the way we normally do, we have to use a conventional wheel loader plus a single drum roller, which is more than twice as expensive. On top of that, there is also double fuel consumption in the compacting alone. Then there are also the purchasing costs of two machines. Here I have just one machine that can do the lot. The compacting indicator in the wheel loader shows exactly how fast you have to drive to achieve the best degree of compacting. The conventional rollers also have devices indicating how high the compacting is, but these are much too complicated for the driver. Here you can already see when driving what the compacting process looks like and how fast you have to drive. This means you can also dispense with one or other of the compacting runs because you can see immediately that the compacting value of the material has been achieved. That is also a tremendous benefit. Yes, and it also indicates if the driver, for example, starts and drives too fast, the display goes down. In some cases then out of the green range and then he can immediately switch back. He can say he will drive a little more slowly again. When the display is moving in the green range, excellent compacting is always guaranteed. Stair plate compactors setting new standards in compacting. Faster, better, more efficient.
with 50% less energy input, with 50% fewer pollutant emissions and 50% less CO2 production. That is our commitment to a better, more sustainable environment. See www.stair.com for more innovative ideas from Stair and www.stair.tv for videos of our machines in use.